morning guys today is Monday I have not brushed my hair this is bedhead obviously no makeup but I did not want to prolong this vlog any longer so we had a wonderful weekend today's Monday by the way had a wonderful wonderful weekend we just were busy every day since like Thursday or Friday so we had a wonderful weekend though and then so I would have last talked to you guys on Saturday when we got we were having payway, which I think I'm gonna upload the vlog I didn't get up yesterday, which I was supposed to but I think I'm gonna try and upload it today That way you guys aren't like already. I am So late on a vlog. This will be like two weeks of a vlog So I think I need to get up today. So chances are this is the first of a vlog anyway Yesterday we woke up and we went to the mall again because he's trying to find himself some board shorts I ended up buying some new earrings at buckle. I have been in to hoop earrings again I always loved hoop earrings and then I just stopped wearing them because I don't know if they were a thing anymore I think they always kind of were but like I just stopped wearing them and so I ended up buying another pack of hoop earrings from buckle and then Do I have any in here? No and then um, we went to Target where I got a new bathing suit bottom. Really boring, nothing special. And that's everything that I got yesterday. We celebrated my father-in-law's birthday. His birthday was Friday, but we celebrated yesterday and we went to Red Lobster with the entire family. And it was just a really good time. Probably a very loud dinner because we were being pretty loud. That's basically it. I need to go clean. I literally just finished like shoving food in my face. So I need to go clean everything up, get the day started. I feel refreshed. I feel so good. I have needed just like a busy fun weekend with my husband for the longest time because so many weekends we do spend still being at the house and I love being in my house. You guys have no idea. I am a homebody. I love being home but there's something about like making sure you're out of the house that is so important and so this weekend I just was out of the house every day all weekend. We were almost never home and that just it makes you refresh. All right so I am back. I am ready to work. Got my entire setup all clean. I kind of like we have my desk, my husband's desk put together and like I clean my desk but I always like expect him to clean his own desk. So like his desk is always like a mess. So I like try to like put his mess like as far out of my like peripheral that I can because it just like it's like oh my gosh I gotta clean it, I gotta clean it. But anyway, so my entire space is nice and clean. I clean the room. I was gonna show you guys me cleaning and everything and I forgot. But everything is cleaned up. Everything is ready for a good work week. I'm excited. I made my own carpet sprinkle carpet powder to freshen up the room. Do I smell it? No. <laughs> um, I used lavender essential oil and I used a ton of drops. It called for like 10 drops. I used like 20 to 25 drops. I used a lot and I still don't smell much in here. But maybe it's just because I've become nose blind because I was vacuuming in here and cleaning in here. Maybe I just don't smell it anymore. But I will say when you use like the commercial one, like the Arm & Hammer carpet powder, it is much stronger than this. Maybe just the essential oil just is supposed to, I don't know. Okay, so I have had a lot of just like cleaning and organizing and stuff happen. So yesterday, my, I, this is the second time that it's actually happened. I put my phone on the bed and I've been using my Life Proof Nude, so that leaves the screen completely you know open and vulnerable and so I threw my Apple remote control onto the bed which this is the same exact scenario has happened in the past and when I did it cracked my screen because the screen that I've been using has been glass screen like a, I don't know it's been glass so when I threw the remote onto the bed it cracked the screen so I was reading a youtubers Twitter account and they had some tweets sent to them and so I happen to be reading some of the responses sometimes like if I see like a tweet that could possibly be controversial or just like a tweet sent out I like to see what the original question was and then I'll read the whole thread and everything total creeper but basically someone had asked her a question that is asked by youtubers all the time it's like my number one asked question it's every youtubers number one asked question and basically someone had asked this youtuber what camera they use and so the youtuber responded by simply saying it's in the description of every single one of their videos and that is a pretty valid response however someone else tweeted back saying well you could have just responded being or you could have just responded without having like an offensive answer and i don't think this youtuber is even gonna like comment back to that but honestly i don't and i know 
technically YouTubers need to be understanding of the fact that not everyone um, like follows them and like has seen old vlogs or old videos or anything like that but like so many times like we have to repeat ourselves over and over and over when really like in every single one of the vlogs you can see info in my description I take the time and every youtuber takes the time to fill out the description which takes probably the most time out of everything linking everything describing everything explaining everything um, you know the description takes a very very long time and so to be asked the same question on a daily basis multiple times where they can just find the answer in the description of your video is frustrating not to mention like i love getting new subscribers so when i start getting in like the same question over and over i know it's because i'm getting new subscribers but no i don't blame her for being frustrated because it is frustrating getting asked the same questions over and over by obviously different people and obviously they're all new subscribers who wouldn't know the answer which is a great thing i love knowing i have new subscribers but it just gets frustrating when like you constantly are repeating yourself she is constantly answering the same question over and over i'll see this youtuber's twitter account and it's constantly the same thing every single day she's constantly answering 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 and it gets frustrating because i don't know if you're a subscriber or you're a follower of mine i have everything already out there i have all the answers answered and i know that's how she feels too and that's why i'm kind of talking in terms of me because I know exactly how she feels. Good morning guys. Today is Tuesday. It has been just a wild past couple of weeks which I knew was going to happen. I warned you guys it was going to happen. So I didn't get a vlog up on Sunday which I think I talked to you guys about. Edited my vlog all up yesterday, uploaded it but I didn't have time to do the title and description and tags and thumbnail and all that fun stuff that goes into it so unfortunately I didn't push it live yesterday but it is uploaded and I will be pushing it live today uh, my mom is actually having surgery today so I'm not too sure like how things are gonna go I'm playing it by ear battery died what else is new so I just have a lot of stuff on my plate right now I have a lot of stuff going on so I'm trying to like scramble to get things done make sure everything's in place so yeah I have to run to my PO box to actually get what I'm filming today so I hope you guys enjoyed that video will be up on Sunday I think you guys will like it What's out there? There's something out there? Yeah, was there something out there you were checking out? Huh? No, Athena, leave it. Yeah, I was just looking out the window. You silly girl. Also, I got a new bottle yesterday. I went ahead and got myself the clear one. This I had seen on Instagram a ton of times and I always wanted to try their bottle out. This is a 40 ouncer. It's like bigger than my head. <laughs> so it looks like a normal size kind of on camera or at least sorta, but it's pretty big, but it's not like annoying big. This one's 40 ounces and I'm making sure I drink a gallon a day because that's what I always did and I always felt the best when I was drinking a gallon a day. So that is just to kind of like keep me motivated to drink that much. Whenever I use like my smaller tumblers, I get so tired of filling it up like a hundred times a day. I just won't drink enough water because I get so tired of getting up, getting water. I know it's really lazy. So I bought this one. So obviously I have to fill it up like three times. It's supposed to be like 3.2 times, but I'll fill it up three times and then that should be good enough. Definitely having more of an anxious day today. I haven't had an anxious day in quite a while but I'm definitely having one today but anyway I'm watching the Fosters right now catching up on some shows I really wanted to watch Teen Mum but I can't get the first two episodes so I'm gonna have to watch it like on my iPad or like stream it from my iPad to the TV but um, I wanted to finish the Fosters because I already had an episode started so I'll watch that after the Fosters is over and I don't know I think I'm growing out of some of these freeform shows like the Fosters is good but it never has really held my attention for a while now anyway it is around lunchtime so I probably should have a little bit to eat we had chicken and quinoa and veggies last night which is one of our like staple dinners and so I think I'm gonna go ahead and have some of that that way my tummy is full I'm almost done with my first bottle of the day I just feel like my head is all over the place today I'm trying to like concentrate on one thing at a time but it's like I can't <laughs> I can't concentrate on one thing at a time um, I just got the phone though with my brother getting all of my ducks in a row making sure everything is working out the way it's supposed to I just am like 
a little bit overwhelmed today and it's like not a lot of stuff so it's like I easily get overwhelmed because I don't know where to start but anyway I am really excited right now because so many of you guys have been like leaving comments on my newest vlog that I uploaded today and just like being so awesome about it there was a few of you guys who were super excited that you were a first to see that vlog and it was so fun to see like you guys be like oh I'm first whenever I get comments from you guys saying first or you're excited that you were one of the first people to comment I get really excited because that means either number one you have notifications on for me or number two you see my video in your subscription and you actually are clicking on my video because you're excited to watch it so that means a lot to me thank you so much not to mention I'm getting like more views on it already than like my last sit down video so I feel so happy to have subscribers who are interested in my vlog they're my favorite to do because I love being able to just be open and one-on-one -on -one with you guys anyway I just want to say thank you guys so much thank you for showing me your enthusiasm and your excitement when I upload a video because that's what's mo that's what motivates me that's what makes me upload as much as I do that's what makes me love what I do that's what makes me want to do this and even if only five of you guys are interested in hearing what I have to say or hear about my life that's five different people who I don't know in real life who are interested to know about me and that's that's a really rewarding and awesome feeling so thank you okay, so I'm feeling like I'm not getting like anything done right now so I am going to go ahead and run to my PO box and pick up my package so I can get started on the video that way I feel like I'm actually getting something done because a lot of the stuff that I need to get done this week um, I have to like wait for so let's go get my package and get started on a video that way I'm at least feeling better I am home I went ahead and started filming a video which took a lot of like pressure and just kind of like angst off my shoulders so I am feeling a lot better right now all right I am officially on bottle number three the only thing I don't like about this is how wide the lip is or like the drinking spout oh my goodness is that rust yeah, I'm pretty sure there is rust on this bottle. So that was weird, but anyways, I cleaned it off. Uh, I don't know what was on it, but I was able to remove it with some vinegar. I went ahead and I filled it back up to the point that I was at, and this is my third bottle, but I filled it up to the point I was at, and now I'm down here. So I only have that much more to go for the day, and I am good. It is so hot in here that like you can see the sun. This is how I work, you know, this time of day. It is so hot in here. I sit down on my chair and it is burning my butt. 